Hi everybody! Hey, uh, it's Roz here from New World Finds. Um, let me know. Uh, let me know when you're when you're here. I didn't realize I only had just my top. Um, say hi when you get on, and um, uh, let me know where you're from. So today we are going to be putting a transfer on this really awesome thing. This is a really old, old, old um, fireplace screen. And they replaced the middle part here with a piece of wood. Hi Priya. So I am going to put um, a transfer here. So I've already painted it and I also dry brushed some white over the top here. So uh, I just tried to make it look a little bit older than it is on the all over here. And then um, I'm also uh, going to distress it and glaze it as well just to make it even more old. So the one I picked was the, uh, it's called My Heart. Um, it's the French transfer that was in the last release. I think it was the only one that had French in it. But it's a really beautiful poem. And when I'm done, I will put it um, in the comments what, uh, what it means. So I'm out of breath. I just had my shipper here picking up a piece and I had to run upstairs. We cut it close. So I'm only going to use, um, it comes with like this, right? So it has like this border and then it has these um, pieces here. And um, I cut these all out. I mean, I cut that all off and I'm just going to use just the words in the middle. And then um, maybe when I'm done, I will cut out the, this border and put that all the way around as well. Hi, Rosemary. Because I think that'd be cute too. All right, so let's get started. We have, it comes in um, three sheets. So it's, uh, this is the middle, this is the top. And then, whoop, and then this is the bottom. So I think that'll work really well on here. And then maybe add the border after just to give it a little extra. All right, so we're going to do the top. And where's my, did I lose my stick already? Where's my stick? I got my stick. Okay. So, I'm going to try and not be in your way while I do this in your visual. So now we have the, uh, the grids now on the transfers. So I'll see if I can show you because I already took the backing off, but you can see there's grids there, right? So what I'm going to do is try and use my middle grid as my, I'm going to use the middle grid as my guide to line it up perfectly with the top, which is right about where this little nick is here. So I'll just go down and I could have measured prior to doing this, but you know, I'm never prepared really. All right, so we're just going to eyeball that and I'm going to try and get out of the way so y'all can still see what I'm doing. Okay, you can. All right, so, and it's, this piece is really old. It needs a little more reinforcing doing certain painting. So that's all I'm doing. All right, so I am going to hop on the other side here and transfer that way because I'm right-handed. All right, so we're just gonna go ahead and you can cut 
and rearrange and place the transfers any which way you like. Obviously, if you're using French words, you want to make sure that they are making sense. So if you don't know French, then you can do a Google search and make sure that what you're putting in your area makes sense. Because you don't want something to say, you know, something strange. You want it to be a flowing sentence. Okay, now you can use the transfer tool if you prefer. Uh, the stick works well and it comes in the tube. So you're already prepared to be able to transfer. It's hard because this moves. And then you just want to go back and forth over everything. Peeling as you go. I'm going to go on this side. Oh, I fell. Just because I was pulling and I didn't want to pull it in case something wasn't attached all the way. All right. And then you're just going to take your hands and your fingers and just double make sure that everything is Double check that everything is adhered. Okay. Had a little bloop, bloop, bloop with the end there. I don't know what happened there. Okay. Good. What is that? You just fold it over. That's okay. We'll just pull it off. Still looks like an end. Okay, and then we'll do our next piece. Hi, Nietzsche. How are you? I'll have to ask you how you pronounce your name. Ni 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 Nisi Nisi or Nietzsche Nietzsche Nisi. I would think. Right? Right? Am I right? Am I wrong? I don't know. It's okay. I get called lots of really strange things, so it is what it is. <laughs> All right, let's line these up. Put some lines on this, like I would if it was a um, a colored piece that I would want to make sure I did not have a line on. Okay, I think I got it pretty good. Okay, and then smooth it out. All right, so now I've done, this one was okay. I didn't need to worry so much about it because it's separate, but this is one big piece here, and this is a big sheet. So in order to make sure I don't have any air bubbles or anything left, I'm gonna take my tool and just horizontally go across my sheet to make sure everything is adhered down. And I don't have any, I won't have any air bubbles to worry about. All right, so I'm popping on the other side now. Okay. Isn't this a really cool piece though? I love these old things and that, you know, that French country, like you could see, you could think that it was in a, an old English countryside manor or something. But this is cool to 
um, you know, repurpose it a bit, do, do something a little different. over there. It's so old that it's kind of <laughs> falling apart. cooperate at all. That's okay. The, the words are always harder to do. sweating here. <laughs> I'm sweating. Good hard work. All right, I'm going to pop over to the other side. Oh my goodness, I keep tripping on my chair. All right, let's see if I can get it to go this side. my fingers to help it. I'll try not to lose the swirl on this side like I did the other. So this used to have an actual screen, you know, a metal screen, and it was repurposed with a, with a piece of wood. really cool for me so that I can do this make it look pretty for them and oh that's a lot of work y'all good lord <laughs> I mean I don't think that's ever been so hard before hi cherry picking <laughs> that's a cute name Make sure we don't have any air bubbles in there. Nope, we're good. Just make sure it's all rubbed down. Cute. It's, it's gonna be really pretty. Some glaze. Make it look nice and old. All right, and then we'll put our bottom piece on. Should be right about there. Wee wee. Wee wee. Right about 
there. Hello, thanks for joining you guys. And then on the other side, I've painted it the same. And so instead of um, putting a transfer, I'm going to use the decoupage paper. And I'll show you which one I picked because I think it's going to look really awesome as a coordinating and not too, too girly look. I want it to be somewhat neutral so that it can be used in anybody's home and not, you know. myself out of the way. Looks pretty. I love it. So now what I could do, guys think I should or not. You think it maybe looks too plain like it is? And then I can do this. I'll cut out that frame. And y'all can tell me if you think I should do the frame. Or just leave it as is and do what you know, the glazing and distressing. Let me cut this one out and then y'all can see and tell me what you think. Cause I'm on the fence about it. Yeah, I think it can go either way. Either way would look good. Okay. So this would go all the way around. Hi, Tammy. So this would go all the way around here. It would go up on the top and it would go on the sides as well. Obviously, I think it would be just a little bit lower because I don't want to cut off the words. So it would be, yeah, about there. And then it would go up the sides. Ooh. Don't fall on me. It would go up the sides and then be on the top as well. What do you think? Should I add that? No frame? You voting no frame? Okay. I wasn't sure. I didn't know if it looked like it needed something else when I was looking at it last night or not. I was really tired. So That's fine. I don't have to put a frame at all. No worries there. I can use that for something else. No? Okay, cool. <laughs> I, that's good to know. So, what I will do now is I'll distress so you can see some of the wood on the frame. And then I will take my glaze and glaze around here just to make it look a little more older and, you know, aged. And then, um, on the back, which is painted the exact same way, I will be putting the, this paper, this decoupage paper, which has all these beautiful uh, scripts and whatnot from, uh, in French. So I think that'll be like fabulous on the back. I think that would look really good. And that is the Zoe uh, Mulberry Tissue Paper from Redesign with Prima. That's that one. So I think that'll look really cool on the back. So this is a beautiful, um, it's a love poem. 
Um, so I kind of thought that was, that was fitting. But this is one of the new ones, the new transfers. So if you like that romantic French vibe, then this will be super perfect for that. Yeah, I think the paper will look awesome on the back because it's the exact same thing. It's all framed out. So the, the paper will sit, and I can show you guys that. It's just a little bit too wide, but that's perfectly fine. I can cut it to fit. But it's going to sit in there just perfectly. See how awesome that's going to look. Of course, my arm's in the way, but like so. It'll fit in there perfectly. It'll be awesome. And I think that's a cool, um, that'd be a cool different look that they can do if they wanted to. Hi, Donna. So they can turn it around if they want and they just want to show the paper side. Or they can turn it to this side and have it where it's got this beautiful French poem. Love poem. It's a love poem. I have to say it's a love poem. But, uh, yeah, so, I mean, that was pretty quick and easy, even though I sweated, but it was still pretty quick, right? But, yep, I think it's going to look really pretty. So keep an eye on the group, and um, I will show you the after probably tomorrow. I will probably stage it and all that tomorrow and take pics, and I will post it in the group. So thanks for joining for that real quick, guys. I appreciate it. Um, I knew it was going to be a quick one today, so um, I appreciate you just hanging out with me for that little bit of time. All right, so have a great day, and I'll see you next Monday. All right, bye.